Hey guys, what's up? It's season of today, and today's custom kind of startup motion startups. We're on an 80 and 181. So, uh, but you, you already know we, we've done this for like 181 weeks at this point. So you already know we got some motion shout out. We got 14 this week. So well, the last two weeks, to be honest. Yeah, without further ado, let's go into it. And our first motion, Osby goes to Brown Motorsports for his first Pierce Never race snapped Richmond for the clash. Welcome to Richmond, folks. Nothing happens in Richmond. It's just pure boring racing. Well, like this year, to watch you watch me entertainment, but still. Christopher Bush is up front somehow. Don't know how that one occurred, but he's up front leading the race. We got battle second going on. That's probably the most interesting battle so far in this race so far. Oh no, here comes Tyler Reddick now. Good for him. Uh, so my shouldn't really smooth. I love the track. I like how there's a little mountain in the background of Richmond, even though there's not really a mountain in the background of Richmond, but apparently there is now. Apparently, no stands are there. But Storm Ocean's really good. I think it's some banking in turns in the bankings and one and two and three and four. That's pretty good. And uh, yeah, that's gonna stay here. I would probably say add some sounds in the background, like racing sounds. Other than that, great motion man, good work, and we'll move on to the next motion of the week. Eric Aaron is running fifth. Something that will never be real life. Oh, here comes Truex, that's a real life thing. And the next motion of it goes to Matthew White for that person racing that Martin's view and Danny Rails is up front. It's typical. More Joe Gibbs racing drivers up front. Oh, and Hart's in the wall. What a what a choke by Danny DeRails. Who cares about him anyway? Uh, Stomachin, really smooth. The track's pretty good. I would say probably have a time lap cancel on the out uh, to know what lap we're on because the leader, uh, the power leader, the leader thing, that's pretty big. Is that spawn just crashed? Who cares about him? I'm talking about uh, leaders currently. And I probably would add some more laps as well. There's only like seven laps in this race. I probably might go up to like ten laps. Other than that, great motion, man. Good work. And we're going to go to the next motion of the week. Ross Jastain's up front as well. What happy rivals we have here. And our next motion, we're going to Camper Racing League racing at Daigo, a.k.a. Talladega. Uh, Kyle Larson is currently up front, leading at Talladega. Like, that's going to end pretty good, though, because it probably won't, because it's Kyle Larson. It's a super speedway. We already know it's going to happen there. At least a joint into second. You think that's Brooks Dust Jr., but it ain't. It's Dennis Carl there, but it's not. Well, it's Dennis, but whatever. Uh, it comes to Frausch Fremery cars now. Carl Edwards in the UPS car. Oh, 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 there he goes. Ricky Stenhouse Jr.'s wrecked himself already. He got wrecked by Clint Boyer, of all drivers, and Jim McMurray continuing to do what Jim McMurray does best and wreck as well. Oh, nice as well. Uh, so I shouldn't really smooth. There's, well, I didn't say so much, but still. Uh, nothing else I've got to say about Camp, but he's always, gone, he's always been many times already, so nothing else I've got to say about him. So, great motion, man. Keep it work, and move on to the next motion of the week. Ricky Spinhouse doing what Big Stuff Jr. does best. And our next emotion of the week goes to the 2016 race nuts. I believe Charlotte because it's the yellow walls, so yeah, Charlotte looks like Charlotte. Oh, and William Byron is blown up already on lap one. That did not take very long for Stone to get out, but apparently he's out. Here comes Garbush on the outside, but Austin is Ryan rules, and he, he's, he's wide and look at Larson, he's just Ryan that wall. Go Larson, not no chase the first pass now, so that's not, that's not good. Garbush off front, no, that's actually pretty good. Uh, that's where he's going to be here many times already. Stone motions are really good. There's, there's nothing I've ever got to say about him. His stone motions are that smooth. So, oh no, Trex Jr's crashed. Oh, that's that's for him. It's 2022, what do you think? Oh no, he just got this on the chase earlier. Oh well, great motion, mate. Good work, and we'll move on to the next motion of the week. And our next motion of the week, I'm going to get this all mudged up. Lionel Cup Series, stop motions in a boxing. Try and say that ten times in a row. Racing that today, oh, no, no, I'm not even going to sing that song. I keep singing it, I don't like it. Alex Baldwin's up front, we got the 33 of the Cavs Growls up front now, like in the 33 for some weird reason. I, I don't know why Cavs Growls are up front. McDowell's left out to dry, who cares about them? Uh, well, single file train racing, guys. Toot toot! What could possibly go wrong here? Oh, something went badly wrong here. Brad Kazelski's on the wall. What a horrible crash. He was all blatant thanks to Ty Dillon. Good on you, Ty. He's got to try to the playoffs here. He needs to wreck every car he needs to. Take out everyone you need to, Ty. I, I don't blame you. He takes out basically the entire backpack. Good on Ty. That, that's just Ty for you. He just, take, he just wrecks cars. He took out basically the entire backfield. Go on him. Anyways, the stop motion's really smooth. Track's really good. Nothing really goes to stay here, so great motion, man. Keep it work, and we'll move on to the next motion of the week. At least time made it through that. Right. Well, we're back right. Okay, Chase, let's back up front. Let's do this. Come on, Chase. Oh, I'm actually going to Chase. Oh, Kaz Growl's back up front, though. He's leading. Good on Kaz. Oh, there's a wreck. Oh, my goodness. Oh, Ty's now dead. Great, now Ty's dead. What a great way to finish your race, Ty. Already up at the top spot. 
there is nothing that can go wrong. Something went very wrong. And our next match, other goes to Bowser 1 for you. Another person in the race in that Bristol, baby! And Kevin Harvick and Montrex Jr. are side by side. Well, not anymore, because Drex Jr. is not leading the field. No, here comes Rick Sals Jr. to the inside. And it's Ricky Icky to the lead. And Bragg Sals, he's free wide on the outside. That's 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 for him. Star motion, it's pretty smooth. Uh, the racing, it's more accurate. Turns 3 and 4, the cars next to a wall. Turn 1 and 2, they're still not next to the wall. I probably would say, oh, and Denny Hamlin's fine now, but who cares about him? It's Denny Hamlin. Don't forget God for that. Oh, and Kevin Harvick and Truex Jr. have crashed thanks to Chase Elliott. Like I say, don't, don't, um, I can't say that, but, oh, that's, that's a pretty good graphic again. Yeah, don't screw up Chase Elliott because he'll get revenge on you. I would say the P word, but I can't, so, yeah. Uh, I would say maybe have the, maybe have the wall come down a little bit in turns one and two. Oh, no, Chase Elliott's been sent to the rear. Well, that sucks for him. The fans ain't happy now. They're turning off the channel immediately. I probably would have the walls in turn 1 and 2 come down a bit. Other than that, Chris motion man, good work, and move on to the next motion of the week. And the next motion over goes to Milk Race Nats, a, a track in Canada. No, it's not Michigan, and no, it's not Kansas, I believe. No, well, we're, we're in Canada, and Alex Bowman's up front, and last and second, apparently, DB's in third. Oh, and the dinger's around. Apparently, he wrecked and turned 1 and 3 and 4, apparently, thanks to Chase Elliott. Classic Chase Elliott. Chase, El Chase Elliott again for the second race in a row has taken out a car. Chase Elliott is out for the blood this week, honestly. He's taking out everyone he sees. The heck, Elliott. Anyway, so much is pretty smooth. Track's pretty good. Other than that, great motion, man. Good work. And move on to the next motion of the week. Chase Elliott, like I said, he's out for the blood. Look out, people. He's coming for you. And the next motion of the week NASCAR Gamer. Once again, for another person in racing that. Hastings. You know Hastings. You know the Battle of Hastings in 1066. I'm kind of learning history currently. It's, it's interesting, but I'm not really interested in it. Anyways, uh, he, he, what's really interesting is the racing. Brad says he's listing the dust in the middle. We've, we're going in the middle, we're going to a replay. Um, interesting. Um, again, I would stop motion. Really smooth. Look, real race accurate, honestly. That, that, that is pretty smooth stop motion. Um, I would say probably um, not go so many replays, more in more into the, the racing. Then else apparently has spun out. Okay, good for him, apparently. I don't know what happened to Stan else. I probably would say have more racing action because there's not much racing action going on. Oh, oh, and Kevin Harvick's wrecked. I, I can't believe no one has gone involved, but Harvick worked out. Have more racing action in this race. Other than that, Chris motion man, give it work, and move on to the next motion of the week. This is Michael Moots reporting live where a nuke was allegedly dropped during today's NASCAR race. And next motion of the week is Napa Cup Series race for the next NASCAR race at Bristol, baby! And Giggles Logano is up front. Needing a good run because let's face it, he's had some horrible runs recently. Bushy Bushy's in second though, sir. So we'll focus on Bushy Bushy. Who cares about him? William Byron on the inside of Malcolm McDowell. He's making some ground up in this race. Good on him. Uh, Storm Ocean, really smooth. Love the graphic. And the graphic. It still makes it. It's a graphic, I guess. Uh, the track's pretty small. I, really would, I probably would make the track a little bit bigger. Other than that, Chris Motion Man, keep it work. And we'll move on to the next motion of the week. Come on, Kyle, get to the inside of the fields already. And the first, the next time I should, oh, it goes to Archie Fox, hopefully this map's name right. But now there's no race net. Hot Vegas, and someone's leading, I don't know who it is, it's a whole wheel car, but Kevin Harvick's right behind him, though, so that's something. Here comes Hart to the inside now. Apparently Austin Dunn's up front, I don't know, on Bobby Truex. Oh, dear. Oh, no, Crusted Cream's crashed again! Sucks for him, no one cares about Custer Cream anymore because he's got Patrick Finney, he should not even be here. Also, I'll say it's going involved in the rap, but who cares about him anyway? Uh, Stone Motion's really smooth, uh, he, he makes very smooth Stone Motion, but doesn't get credit for it. Honestly, go subscribe to this guy, because this dude, he can make Stone Motion. This Stone Motion is honestly the smoothest ones I have ever seen. So, go subscribe, not yet. So, great Motion Man, give it work. I probably would, also, I probably, uh, the only thing I probably would say is probably spread out the cards a bit more. Other than that, Grace Motion Man, kid work, and move on to the next motion of the week. And the next time it goes to Josh for another person that racing that Walkins Glen, and obviously Chase has leading the Walkins because it's Walkins Glen. Chase has to go up here. Uh, the field's flying by. Oh, no, I know he's around, taking another car with him, but okay, what is going on? We've got train, we've got pack racing at Walkins Glen, ladies and gentlemen. Oh, what is going on? Chase Elliott's racing this way in there. Okay, we've got some slow racing. Okay, what is going on? Jimmy Johnson's following someone out. I can't keep up with this race! I love the graphics though. Graphics are really good. That definitely looks like NBC's graphics. 
Um, I probably would say the stop motion is pretty fast and it is hard to tell what's going on. So probably still the cast in a tiny tad a little bit. And have to feel spread out a bit more as... Oh, God, that's That sucks. Probably have the car spread out a bit more and not have them, like, do some pack racing at Wolves Glen. Now, they are wrecking everywhere at this point. So probably just have some... Have the car spread out a bit more on the race. Other than that, still good slow motion. So great slow motion, man. Keep it work and move on to the next motion of the week. Uh, first motion of the ghost in Nigel 83, so I've his name. For that person now racing at the LA Wooden Railway Coliseum. I'm sorry, it's the LA Coliseum, not the Wooden Railway Coliseum. We got Willie B. Byron, all they reckon already. It's Jerry Lagano and Kevin Harves. It was Kevin Harvey who caused the incident, and it wasn't Chastain. Honestly, we wish it was Chastain, however. Uh, slow motion, really smooth. Uh, track, it's wooden railway tracks, so I'm not going to complain there. I, I used to make tracks like that when I was young, so I don't complain. Other than that, it's very smooth slow motion. Uh, maybe take a few more pitch. Oh, there's a wreck on the restart, and Carbush involved in it. Leave Carbush alone, please. Doesn't need any more wrecks for him. Other than that, great slow motion, man. Give it a word. Just take a couple more pictures, and move on to the next motion. Of the week. Our uh, next question oh, goes to uh, CCCS Racing, racing at Michigan and Austin Spindrix up front. Good on him. Uh, Stop motion, really smooth. Uh, I see the hands are in the way again this time, all the legs, so that's pretty good. Uh, we've got a custom photo line car up front. Don't worry, it's not Ryan Sieg, because Ryan Sieg would not be a friend in the NASA Cup Series race unless he finds some wins. Finally, finds some wins in the Xfinity Series. Hopefully, that can happen today in the Xfinity Series race today at Talladega. Like a bigger studio race, but you never know. Some motion, still really smooth. Um, I probably was spread the cars a bit more. And no, they're not pack racing at Michigan. Other than that, great motion, man. Give it work, and we'll move on to the next motion. Oh, well, last motion of the week, because there's really nothing to say here. Just uh, oh, oh no, there is something to say here. Harrison Burns wrecked like half the field. Suarez, Busher, and Grills. Harrison, why are you back? Why, why have you come back to the series? Why, why are you doing this? Why are you taking it half the field? Look, you know you're down when it comes to series when Todd Gillen is doing better than you. He's got two top tens so far this year. I'm just saying, I'm just saying. Uh, get, just get your act together, bit, Harrison. Uh, we're just going to move on to last match week. Harrison Burton is up to no good again. And our final match, all goes to cool cup series racing at Seattle Dega. That's what I'm calling it, because it looks like Tyler Dega, but it's Seattle. But I call it Seattle Dega. So we got Willie B. Byron up front, and guess he's up front, folks. It's the man, the myth, the legend himself. Ty Dillon, Ultra X. Who cares about top tri Screw off, Truex. Ty Dillon's up front. Go, my boy. He's up. He's on that third lane. Come on. Oh, and Noah Gregson's in, this, in trouble on lap two. Lap three, sorry. Oh, that sucks, Noah Gregson. Who cares about him? What else could possibly go on in this race? Oh, Summer and Bally won in race. And Kyle Busch is wrecked again. Can we just stop wrecking Kyle Busch, please? I beg of you people. You've wrecked him way too much this week. One week you've had him wrecked out. Please, I beg of you. McDowell's in trouble. Who cares about him? Kyle Busch is wrecked out of the race. Great. Anyways, uh, never has a good say here, so stop motion's really smooth. Um, yeah, that's really it. Stop motion's really smooth. Track's pretty good. And uh, yeah, never has a good say here. So, great motion, man. Keep it at work. This is painful. I'm just going back to the booth. Jared Agarin, it's all your fault, mate. This is all your fault. Yes! 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 No! 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 Keep that in mind. That that was Rick Estelle's junior felt. Ty had nothing to do with it. He had nothing to do with it. Thank you, Stan Alves. Just thank you, man. Thank you very much. Anyways, guys, those are all the most fun in the last two weeks. Grace Mo's made everyone's the most in the last two weeks, and everyone who made the episode. So, uh, good on you. If you want to watch my so much race this week, well, yeah, this week or the last week, basically now, I recommend you watching it because it's a pretty good watch. Anyways, that's for me. Let's go. Leave me a note. I'll see you guys in two weeks' time for the next time I share this video. And I'll see you guys whenever I post another video again. So, yeah. It's me, it's Noah, because that's Noah, though. Bye, guys.